targets are men themselves, uh, and of course also politicians, and particularly men politicians. Uh, men are notoriously bad at looking after their own health. They don't want to know, they don't go and ask the doctor until it's uh, too late. Uh, they don't take precautions, they don't live healthily. Uh, women are much better at doing this, partly of course because they uh, look after the health of their children and their family. Uh, so we have to get the message across to men uh, in ways that they will understand uh, and to show that we understand sometimes the health problems that men do have, um, which perhaps they don't want to talk about. Uh, and secondly, we need to get to uh, politicians. Now, politicians have so many other things on their mind, whether it's uh, currencies or wars or droughts or famines or, or um, local uh, crises and hooliganism, football matches, whatever. Um, and getting their attention on health issues is, is not easy. They have to be helped to understand, uh, helped to understand that you can't have uh, a healthy economy uh, unless you have uh, healthy people, uh, and helped to understand that uh, there are specific things to do with men's health which they should uh, be aware of. Uh, and um, to achieve this, I think we, uh, we have to use every device to attract attention. Um, we have to uh, um, talk in simple terms, we have to take uh, not just a problem but uh, a suggested solution to the problem uh, to the politicians to uh, um, help them to understand but also to know what to do about it. Uh, and we have to attract their attention, um, sometimes uh, getting uh, children and young people to come and talk to them, uh, sometimes getting uh, personalities, celebrities to, uh, to come.